Good afternoon. The weekend is almost over and I'm getting some fishing in. Sunday, well it's late Sunday afternoon. I shall have me 30 minutes, maybe 45 minutes, something like that, just a, a short session. I'm continuing with my mini jigging approach as you can no doubt see there from the rod in my hand. Just gently teasing the lure through the water. Number one, it's working out for me very well at the moment with stuff going on. We're pushing on with the decorating now, started painting. And do you know what? My wife's doing it. Isn't she a star? She loves it actually. She enjoys painting. And I'm fishing and my wife's doing some decorating at home. What a woman. But number two, I actually like this type of fishing. So it's not exactly a hardship just to have a limited amount of time and to use it in this way. Whatever type of fishing I do, I must say, I always like it. This is proving to be a very slow session. Indeed, I've had quite a number of casts now with just one pluck to show for it. No fish though, on the bank, which is what counts ultimately, doesn't it? However, I keep casting, I keep working that lure, and I keep believing that I will get something. Not that it's a big thing, of course, if you're blank, but it has been a while since I went on a fishless lure session. So I'm certainly enjoying catching perch and pike along the way. And hopefully that's the case today as well. We shall see though, it is most definitely a tough one. My faith has been rewarded. It's only a small perch, but this could be the thin line between catching and not. I have moved to a number of different swims as well trying to locate some fish. Just this one though, so far. I'm actually very surprised because the phone that I record on, I just knocked in the water. It was in the margins, but nevertheless fully submerged. It's about a foot there. I got it out and thought to myself, this doesn't look good. However, it seems to be okay. But I do think that when I actually put the video together, the sound might be a bit distorted. The clarity of my image on the screen looks okay right now, but we shall see, won't we? It's not the end of the world, but I would like the phone to continue to function properly. I am getting a few more plucks now. <laughs> not when I cast like that, I won't. <laughs> a little bit of a tangle at the end of the the rod there, that happens doesn't it, when you braid fish in, especially when it's windy. Having said that, the wind's dropped as well, so I haven't got any excuses, have I? Well, I've got a little bit more fishing time left, and if the fish are coming on the feed, plus I've located a few anyway, seems just like small perch out there, I tell you what, I'll be happy to increase my tally of one. I just had a really good pull then actually. It reminded me, if you see fish, you'll know what I'm talking about. When the whiting snatch at the bait and, and pull at it, and you feel that fish on just for a, a brief moment. That's what it reminded me of. I'm talking of whiting. I haven't done any sea fishing at all for ages. However, that's another thing I want to put right as well, now that we're back to a little bit more uh, normality as far as living is concerned. Mind you, I've been living as normal during the COVID situation. Just restricted, that's all, and particularly with travel. So I haven't been on holiday since March 2020, just a little bit of a snag on the bottom there. No holiday at all this year, but we will get back to business in 2022. Sounds like a long 
way off in the future, doesn't it? It's only a few months. I'm back home now. As you can see there, everything's rather chaotic. And here's the decorator that I've been talking about earlier. What have you been up to while I've been fishing? Painting the kitchen tonight. Does it look nice? Yeah. Well, I'm going to have a look there in a moment. Have you got any more plans for decorating tonight? Just being the extra woman. What a woman. 